Oh, I return again. Time to do things. Dun 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 dun. Look at this bike. You rest your hand on the rusted bike. Its horn wheezes a honk of despair. I feel that. A beat up desk de 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 desktop computer. The inside is empty. So sad. It's a cooler. It has no brand and shows no signs of wear. Inside are a couple of freeze dried space food bars. Fuck yes. I'm. Excuse you. Oh, get out of here, you piece of shit. Through the dog residue on the ground like the piece of trash it is. <laughs> Harsh. Sweet. It's a DVD case for an anime. Desperate claw marks cover the edges. Oh my god. Seems like a regular training dummy. Do you want to beat it up? No. Stare into each other's eyes for a moment. Okay. <gasps> dun dun dun. Ha ha ha! Too intimidated to fight me, huh? I am a ghost that lives inside a dummy. My cousin used to live inside a dummy too, until... YOU came along! When you talked to them, they thought they were in for a nice chat. But the things you said... Horrible. Shocking. Unbelievable. It spooked them right out of their dummy. Human! I'll scare your soul out of your body. Okay. No, you won't. Sorry to tell you that, but I'm gonna talk to you. You talk to the dummy. Doesn't seem much for conversation. No one is happy with this. Feeble, feeble, feeble! Whoop! Ow, you dummies! Watch where you're aiming your magic attacks. Hey, you! Forget anything about- forget I said anything about magic. I'll defeat you and take your soul. Nah. Fuck. Shit. Mad dummy glares into a mirror and then turns to you with the same expression. How unfortunate. I'll use your soul to cross the barrier! Okay. Mad Dummy is doing an armless sky dance. I'll dance in the window of a fancy store. Or a standing window. Shut the fuck. You. Oop, whoops, 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 whoops. Oh, fuck. Okay. You ate the quiche. Then everything I want will be mine. Dummy is getting cotton all over the dialogue box. Mm. Huh? Yeah! Uh, okay, I totally fucking see what you just said. Mad Dummy. Okay. What was their name again? You are literally such a fucking pain in my ass. Whatever, whatever, whatever! You're a pain in my ass, but I kind of feel like I feel you. <laughs> feeble, feeble, feeble! God damn it. God. Okay, yes, I know, I'm feeble. God. Covered this. Take that, you piece of shit! Hey guys! Dummies, dummies, dummies! Remember how I said not to shoot at me? Well, failures! You're fired! You're all being replaced! <laughs> now you'll see my true power. Relying on people that aren't garbage. Mechanical worms fill the room. Dummy bots, magic missile. Oh, I hate this. I hate this. Oh my god, I hate this. 
get wrecked. Okay. Dummy bots, try again! Ah, oh, shit. Okay, that didn't work. That didn't work. Dummy bots! You're awful! Okay, 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 okay. Can't believe I avoided all those. Dummy bots! Final attack! Oh shit, okay, I hate this. Fuck, 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 fuck. Nope, 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 nope. No way! These guys are even worse than the other guys. Who cares? Who cares? Who cares? Why do you always repeat things? I don't need friends. I've got knives! I'm out of knives. But it doesn't matter. You can't hurt me and I can't hurt you. You'll be stuck fighting me. Forever. Forever. Forever! I can't, this hurts my fucking throat to talk like him. What? What the heck is this? Ugh! Acid rain? Oh, forget it. I'm out of here. Bye. Naps to Bluke! S sorry I interrupted you, didn't I? As soon as I came over, your friend immediately left. Oh no, you guys looked like you were having fun. Oh no, I, I just wanted to say hi. Oh no. God. He's so fucking precious. Well, I'm gonna head home now. Oh, um, feel free to come with if you want. But no pressure. I understand if you're busy. It's fine. No worries. Just thought I'd offer. You're so freaking cute. Hey. My house is up here, in case you want to see, or, or in case you don't. Bye. You feel a calming tranquility. You're filled with determination. Hell yeah. Whoa. I... okay. What? 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 It's a living. Yeah. Yes, it is. It's locked. Okay. Oh. Napster Luke. Oh, you really came. Sorry, I wasn't expecting that. It's not much, but make yourself at home. Oh yeah, I'm play it. Oh, are you hungry? I can get you something to eat. <laughs> this is a ghost sandwich. Do you want to try it? Sure. You attempt to bite into the ghost sandwich. You phase right through it. Oh. Never mind. Oh. <laughs> after, er, after a great meal, I like to lie on the ground and feel like garbage. God, it's me! It's a family tradition. Do you want to join me? Sure! Okay, follow my lead. Here we go. You lie down as long as you don't move. So, only move around when you want to get up, I guess. This is nice. This is a good time. Uh, wait, what? <gasps> oh my god, I forgot about this. Why does this happen? I can't. Oh my god. The space thing when you lay down with Naps Luke? Yeah. Well, that was nice. Thank you. Yeah, no problem, Mom. Oh, that's my TV. There's a show I like to watch on it sometimes. Yeah. Uh. I'm gonna keep working on that mix CD. He's actually me, because all I fucking do is make mix CDs. <sighs> the, 
computer's internet browser is open to a music sharing forum. It's a spider web. There's a flyer for a bank sale on it. This CD is labeled Gula Day Music. Sure. <laughs> Some good music. City is labeled Spook Wave. Play it. Oh, it's just different version of that one. Okay. Alright. Bye, Blue Key. Look at these snails! It's a snail. For some reason, you can't help but wonder what it tastes like. Ooh. Snail snail, a long journey extends in front of you. Snail snail, reach far. <laughs> Excuse me. Reach far and stretch beyond the horizons. Snail snail, so snail it's Sam Buell. I've been long overdue for a second house. Okay. The snail is counting dollar bills. Me too. Hey, Blue. Awkward. I'm working right now. I mean, welcome to Fluke's family snail farm. Yeah, I'm the only employee. This place used to get a lot of business, but our main customer disappeared one day. Now it's just some hairy guy that shows up once a month. Yeah. Do you want to play a game? It's called Thunder Snail. The snail will race, and if the yellow snail wins, you win. It's 10G to play. Sure. Okay. Uh, yeah, okay. I'm gonna fuck this up. Fuck. Fuck. Shit. Fuck. Shit. What? Calm down. Wait, what? Why? I'm so confused. Okay. What the fuck? If you press Z, it doesn't move. God. Go. This reminds me of that SpongeBob episode. <laughs> Gary, no! G oh, you both tried your best, but the snail looks discouraged. Her best wasn't good enough. Oh. Oh. No, your best was good enough. It's okay. God. North Blue Acres, East Hotman, Tiny Village. It's over here. Duck! I don't want to go over there. Okay. Oh, okay, yeah. Uh, good. Um, I'm gonna put a couple of ice creams in there, yeah. Wait, okay. I'm gonna drop that punch card. I really don't need it. Um. Mm. Ooh, hell yeah. Wait, what? Okay. Um, I'm just gonna buy one of these. And I'm gonna talk to you. About yourself. I've been around a long time, maybe too long. Studying history sure is easy when you've lived through so much of it yourself. Waha! Eh? You don't know what this is? What are they teaching you kids in school nowadays? Waha! That's the Delta Rune, the emblem of our kingdom. The kingdom of monsters. Waha! Great name, huh? It's always as I say. Old King Fluffy Buns can't name for beans. That emblem actually predates written history. The original meaning has been lost to time. All we know is that the triangles symbolize us monsters below, and the winged circle above symbolizes something else. Most people say it's the angel from the prophecy. Oh yeah, the prophecy. 
Legend has it, an angel who has seen the surface will descend from above and bring us freedom. Lately, the people have been taking a bleaker outlook, calling that winged circle the Angel of Death. A harboringer of destruction, waiting to free us from this mortal realm. In my opinion, when I see that little circle, I just think it looks neat. Wah! King Fluffy Buns? He's a friendly, happy-go-lucky kind of guy. If you keep walking around long enough, you'll probably meet him. He loves to walk around and talk to people. Eh? Why do I call him Dreamer Fluff- or why do I call Dreamer Fluffy Buns? Oh, that's a great story. I don't remember it. But if you come back later, I'm sure I'll have remembered by then. Undyne? Yeah, she's a local hero around here. Through grit and determination alone, she fought her way to the top of the Royal Guard. Actually, she just came through here asking about someone who'd look just like you. I'd watch your back, kid. And buy some items. It might just save your hide. Okay. Be careful out there, kid. Thanks. Alright, so those make me invincible longer. Like, when I get hit by something, um, it makes it so that kill a man. Not really, though. I just lost my train of thought. Hurt, beaten, and fearful, fearful for our lives, we surrendered to the humans. Seven of their greatest magicians sealed us underground with a magic spell. Anything can enter through the seal, but only beings with a powerful soul can leave. There is only one way to reverse this spell. If a huge, equival if a huge power equivalent to seven human souls attacks the barrier, it will be destroyed. But this cursed place has no entrances or exits. There is no way a human could come here. We will remain trapped down here forever. You know what? I'm gonna try something. Hey, I'm gonna call Toriel. Nobody picked up. Uh. Said hello from the other side. <laughs> oh wait, I didn't mean to call her again. I meant to call Pap. What's that strange whisper? I might have to hang up. Oh. Whoa. Whoa, he can... He can hear the echo flowers. Oh my god, Pap can hear the fucking echo flowers, and they're saying some not-so-cool stuff because he seemed nervous. Special enemy Temmie appears here to defeat you. I'm gonna feed her some Temmie flakes. Temmie only wants the Temmie flakes. No, so hunger dies. Okay. You're fucking... Oh shit. Okay. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, this is strange. You say hello to Temmie. Hoi, I'm Temmie. I hate this, I hate this, I hate this, I hate this. Ah, no, ah, fuck you. Wait, no, I didn't. Fuck, I didn't even do that. Okay, I can spare her, thank god. Okay, uh, that was weird. I remember this. But this cursed place has no entrances or exits. There is no way a human could come here. We will remain trapped down here forever. Seriously, what was Pap hearing on the phone though? Because he was hearing the echo flowers, but he seemed so fucking nervous. Like, why? What are they saying? Call him again. Papyrus isn't home right now. Dude, seriously. Okay, that's weird. That is really weird. Ah. Oh shit, okay. Use approach multiple. Suddenly! Gleh. Oh. See, that's so fucking gross, honestly. Oh my god. Look 
Wiggly I will unhug. You don't hug Moldblug, it appreciates your respect of its boundaries. Chased Wiggle. Alright, cool. Uh, I gotta... Oh, wait, no, okay. Wait, is this where I can- YES! Oh my god. Hoi! Welcome to Tam Village! Hoi! I'm Temmy! And this is my friend, Temmy! This is literally the weirdest fucking thing. Hoi! I'm Temmy! And this is my friend, Temmy! Hoi! I'm Temmy! Don't forget my friend! Hi. I'm Bob. <laughs> Rich history of time. You feel... something. You're filled with determination. Hoi! You should check out Tem Shop! Uh, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, I agree! You should check Tem Shop! Oh, wah, 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 wah. Humans, such a... Cute! Statue of Tem, very famous. Very! Tem watch egg. Egg will hatch. Tem proud parent. It's hard boiled. You know what? Me too. Tem her da- human allergies to Tem. That okay. Tem understand. Tem also allergic to Tem. There she go. <laughs> the poor thing. Hoives! <laughs> Mushroom dance. Mushroom dance. Whatever could it mean. It symbolizes my inner torment, trapped here by my high bay. <laughs> my struggle to pull away. My struggle to escape. But alas, to no avail. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna... What happens if you go again? Mushroom dance. Mushroom dance. Whatever could it mean. If only I could see the world above. But even if the barrier was open, how would I leave? Do you just keep saying different things? Oh, no, okay. Feeling of being watched. Fucking weird. Boy, welcome to the temp shop! I'm not going to pay for. T what? Temp? It heals 2 HP. This also heals 2 HP. And this... Also heals 2 HP, but it's just- oh my god. College, Tem, pursue higher education. Can I? You don't have the muns. Whoop. Hoi. Hoi! I'm Temmy. Hoi. Timmy. Us Tems have a deep history. Okay. Yeah, yeah, go to Tem Shop. You fucking weird, mate. Boy. God. I'm getting out of here. Y'all are fucking weird ass motherfuckers. Oh, it really ends right there. Okay. I hate this. Wait, ah, motherfucker. Guys. Ugh. Fuck, 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 Oh, okay. Thanks, Aaron. Aaron! Aaron is admiring his own muscles. Yeah, I know. You're fucking weird. Uh, come on. Your sweat does nothing. Actually, it does do something to me. God. Ah! Wow. Alright, that was skillfully maneuvered. Come on. That was stupid. 
He flexes himself out of the room. Okay. I got. Ooh, I got a lot of gold for that, actually. Where am I going? Where did I go to Tem Village? Okay. What the fuck? Oh, okay. I don't remember doing that. Did it just light everything up for me? Still itchy everywhere. God. Without candles or magic to guide them home, the monsters used crystals to navigate. Yeah. Fuck, 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 wait. Okay. Mm. God. Good now. I don't have to worry about you. Smells like a bait shop. Ew. Oh shit, fuck. I like was not paying attention. I was looking at something else. Okay. Ooh. Wait, what happens if I call someone here? Um, okay. Can you eat them? I'm seriously out of ideas here. <laughs> oh, Pat. Shit, fuck, shit, fuck, fuck, shit, shit, fuck. Nope, okay. Motherfucker. Ah. Uh. I can't fucking see anything. Fuck. God, guys, go away. Don't want to deal with your shit right now. Where am I? Oh my god. I already went this way. Fuck. Oh my god, thank god. Wait, fuck. Okay, 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 okay. Mm! Guys, just leave me alone, please. Oh, God, okay. Fucking finally. Ah, <laughs> oh, it's dark and I don't like this. Behind you. Motherfucker! Honestly, that was a huge, like, dorky thing to do. Like, she had to go up to the flower, whisper into it behind you. So, like, God, that's just, that's dorky. Seven. Seven human souls. With the power of seven human souls, our king, King Asgore Dreamer, will become a god. With that power, Asgore can finally shatter the barrier. He will finally take the surface back from humanity and give them back the suffering and pain that we have endured. Understand, human? This is your only chance at redemption. Give up your soul, or I'll tear it from your body. We really gonna do this? Really gonna fucking do this? You bitch. Oh, hey, Undyne, I'll be fight. What? Yo. You did it! Undyne is right in front of you! You've got front row seats to her fight! <gasps> Wait... 
Who's she fighting? H hey! You aren't gonna tell my parents about this, are you? God. <laughs> well, okay. You hear passing conversation? Hmm. If I say my wish, you promise you won't laugh at me? Of course I won't laugh. Wait, I'm gonna call. There's no response. Fuck. Someday, I'd like to climb this mountain we're all buried under. Standing under the sky, looking at the world all around? That's my wish. You hear laughter. Hey, you said you wouldn't laugh at it. Sorry, it's just funny. That's my wish, too. Aww. However, there is a prophecy. The angel, the one who has seen the surface. They will return, and the underground will go empty. God. Yo! Yo, I know I'm not supposed to be here, but... I want to ask you something. Man, <laughs> I've never had to ask anyone this before. Um, yo, you're human, right? <laughs> Man, I knew it! Well, I know it now, I mean. Undyne told me, um, stay away from that human. So, like, um, I guess that makes us enemies or something. But I kind of stink at that. <laughs> Yo, say something mean so I can hate you? Please? No. No. Yo, what? So I have to do it? Here goes nothing. Yo, I... I hate your guts. Man, I... I'm such a turd. I'm gonna go home now. Oh no. Y yo, wait! Wait! Help, I tripped! God, Undyne, you piece of fucking shit. Y y yo, dude, if, y if you want to hurt my friend, you're going to have to get through me first. Silly Undyne. You are no match for the power of friendship! She's gone. Yo, you really saved my skin. Guess being enemies was just a nice thought. <laughs> we'll just have to be friends instead. Man, I should really go home. I bet my parents are worried sick about me. L later, dude. Bye. He's the best. He is the bomb.com. God, oh God. Seven. Seven human souls, and King Asgore will become a god. Six. That's how many we have collected thus far. Understand? Through your seventh and final soul, this world will be transformed. First, however, as is customary for those who make it in this make it this far, I shall tell you the tragic tale of our people. It all started long ago. No. You know what? Screw it! Why should I tell that story when you're about to die? Gah! <laughs> My wife. You! You're standing in the way of everybody's hopes and dreams. Alphys's history books made me think humans were cool with their giant robots and flowery swordswoman. But you? You're just a coward. Hiding behind that kid so you can run away from me again. And let's not forget your wimpy goody two-shoes shtick. Oh, I'm making such a difference by hugging random strangers. You know what would be more valuable to everyone? If you were dead. That's right, human. 
Your continued existence is a crime. Your life is all that stands between us and our free and our freedom. Right now, I can feel everyone's hearts pounding together. Everyone's been waiting their whole lives for this moment, but we're not nervous at all. When everyone puts their hearts together, they can't lose. Now, human, let's end this right here, right now. I'll show you how determined monsters can be. Step forward when you're ready. <laughs> I can't laugh like her. Wind is howling. You're filled with determination. Okay. That's it, then. No more running away. Here I come! I hate this. I fucking hate this. On guard! You told Undyne you didn't want to fight, but nothing happened. As long as you're green, you can't escape. Unless you learn to face danger head on, you won't last a second against me. I'm literally so bad at this. Undyne flips her spear visionly. Not bad! Then how about this? For years, we dreamed of a happy ending. Oh. And now, sunlight is just within our reach. I won't let you snatch it away from us! Enough warming up! Fuck, 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 shit, fuck. No, motherfucker! Oh no, fuck, shit, I didn't mean to do that, I didn't mean to do that, I didn't mean to do that! No, 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 fuck, shit! Fuck! Ah! Okay, there we go. Gotta go, gotta go fast, gotta go fast, gotta go fast, gotta go really fast. You can walk faster than that! <laughs> you won't get away from me this time. Fucking watch me. Are those claws natural? Honestly, I'm doing you a favor. But I didn't mean to do that. No human has ever made it past Asgore. And you're a bitch. Killing you now is an act of mercy. So stop being so damn resilient. Wait, fuck, fuck, shit. Ha, bitch. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. No, nope, no, nope. ah, no, no. God, you've escaped from me for the last time. Great, I'm gonna, yeah. Alpha's told me humans were determined. I hate those, I hate those ones so fucking much. Undyne thinks of her friends and pounds the ground with her fists. I see now what she meant by that. But I'm determined too. Oh, wow, I can't believe I got all those, damn. Determined to end this right now. Fuck. Right now! Ah, oh, motherfucker. Right. Now. Okay. Okay, good. <laughs> Wait, what? Undying draws. Ah! Undying draws her finger across her neck. Shh, because you're fucking dork. Die already, you little brat! <laughs> Wait, fuck. Okay, 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 stop. Undying. Undying! Calm down! Bye. I'm out of here. Hey, 
What's up? I was just thinking. You, me, and Undyne should all hang out sometime. I think you would make great pals. Let's meet up at her house later. Nope. I would rather not. Stop running away! Uh, no. Sans, wake up, you lazy motherfucker! God. Armor. So hot. But I can't give up. Yes, you can. It's okay. Just give in. Love yourself. It's a water cooler. Yep. Hey, Undyne. Gotta fucking... Yeah. Do the thing! Boop! She's like, what the fuck just happened? I don't know how to feel about this. Okay, bye. Is Sans at the station? No, he's not. Excuse me. Oh! You're in Hotland now! Hey, Sans, aren't you supposed to be there? <coughs> Don't worry. I am. Phew! What the fuck, Sans? Wait, what happens if I call again? Finally! Sans is doing his job! <laughs> no, he's not. <laughs> what the fuck are you? Okay, 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 okay. I was thirsty, so I came over from Waterfall to get a drink. That doesn't make any sense, you silly Billy. Seeing such a strange laboratory in a place like this, you're filled with determination. Hey guys. Sorry, Undyne, like, told us there was totally a human in the area. So, like, us rail guards are blocking out the elevators for now. Even if the elevators aren't working anyway, we'll do our best, Miss Undyne. He's a quiet one. No. Ba -ba -ba -da -ba -ba -da. Oh, my god. I didn't expect you to show up so soon. I haven't showered, I'm barely dressed, oh, I'm, it's all messy, and... Um... Uh, hiya! I'm Dr. Alphys. I'm Asgore's royal scientist. But, uh, I'm not one of the bad guys. Actually, since you stepped out of the ruins, I've, um been observing your journey through my console. <laughs> your fights, your, your friendships, everything. I was originally gonna stop you, but watch someone on screen really makes you root for them. S so, um, I wanna help you. Using my knowledge, I can easily guide you through Hotland. I know a way right to Asgore's castle, no problem. W well, actually, um, there's just a tiny issue. A long time ago, I made a robot named Metaton. Originally, I built him to be an entertainment robot. Uh, you know, like a robotic TV star or something. Anyway, recently I decided to make him more useful. You know, just some small practical adjustments. Like, um, anti-human anti combat features? Uh, of course, when I saw you coming, I immediately decided I have to remove those features. Unfortunately, I may have made a teensy mistake while doing so, and, um, now he's an unstoppable killing machine with a thirst for human blood. <laughs> but, um, hopefully we won't run into him. I sure hope so. Except we will. Huh? D did you hear something? Oh no. Oh yes! Welcome, beauties! 
to today's quiz show. Oh boy, I can already tell it's gonna be a great show. Everyone give a big hand for our wonderful contestant. Never played before, gorgeous? No problem, it's simple. There's only one rule. Answer correctly. Or you die. Motherfucking shit. Nah. No. Nah, no, I'm not gonna cry. Let's start with an easy one. What's the prize for answering correctly? Uh. More questions. Right, sounds like you get it. Here's your terrific prize. What's the king's full name? Score Dreamer. Oh, Alphys is helping me. I didn't realize she makes the letters with her hands. Enough about you. Let's talk about me. What are robots made of? Metal and magic. Too easy for you, huh? Here's another easy one for you. Yeah, you know what? Aw, thanks, Alphys. Don't count on your victory. Correct! You're so lucky today! Alphys is cheating, but that's okay. Let's play memory game. What monster is this? It's Metaton. Yep. I'm so flattered you remembered! But can you get this one? Heck yeah. Great answer! I love it! Here's a simple one. How many letters in the name Metaton? Of course that was easy for you. Time to break out the big guns. In the dating simulation video game- okay. Oh, I know this one is it's snail ice cream in the fourth chapter. Everyone goes to the beach and she buys ice cream for all of her friends, but it's snail flavor and she's the only one who wants it. So one of my favorite parts of the game, it's actually a very powerful message about friendship and... Alphys, Alphys, Alphys. You aren't helping our contestant, are you? Oh, you should have told me. I'll ask a question. You'll be sure to know the answer to. Who does Dr. Alphys have a crush on? I'm dying. See, Alphys? I told you it was obvious. Even the human figured it out. Yes, she scrawls her name in the margins of her notes. She names programming variables after her. She even writes stories of them together. Sharing a domestic life. I'm smiling so fucking hard right now. Sharing a domestic life. Probability of crush, 101%. Margin of error, error 1%. Well, well, well. With Dr. Alphys helping you, the show has no dramatic tension. We can't go on like this. But, but, this was just the pilot episode. Next up, more drama, more romance, more bloodshed. Until next time, darlings. God. Well, uh, that was certainly something. It sure as heck was. Wait, wait! I was just gonna go check stuff out. Let me give you my phone number. Then, maybe if you need help, I could... Wh where'd you get that phone? It's ancient! It doesn't even have texting! Wait a second, please. H here, I upgraded it for you. It gives you texting, items, it's got a keychain. I even signed you up for the Underground's number one social network. Now we're officially friends. <laughs> I'm going to the bathroom. Have fun. Think of me. Save me a seat. It's a video feed of your location. It's a garbage can, but it's pretty cute. It's a computer. It's accessing some kind of puzzle in Snowden. It's a beat-up figurine of a female human with cat ears. It's a teacup shaped like a yellow lizard. It's full of soda. Fridge is filled with instant noodles and soda. Take a package of noodles. Hell yeah. It's a bag of dog food. It's half full. 
Wait, what? <gasps> oh! Oh. The space behind the wall is only a few feet wide. Okay. Yellow feet are tapping just behind the door. Look at her, she's so cute. Scientific books, they seem very dusty. All these books are labeled human history. Sure. Look inside a book. It's a comic of a giant robot fighting a beautiful alien princess. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. I don't know what you're talking about, but... <laughs> that happens every day around here. Ah, Michigan. <laughs> VHSs and DVDs of various cartoons, they are all labeled human history. Oh, Alphys. All these books are the... Okay. Inside a book, it's a comic book. Two scantily clad chefs are flinging energy pancakes at each other. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. Excuse the fuck out of you. All these hu books are labeled human history. You look inside a book, it's a comic book. A huge, hideous android is running to school with toast in its mouth. It's late for anime school! Pink goop drips from this strange machine. It's like the Teletubby thing. Looks like Alphys' work table seems dusty. Okay. No, no. This wardrobe is full of dirty lab coats and a single clean dress. There are letters from many monsters here. Froggit, Snowy, Doggo. They're all unopened. It's a lamp with pink fish on the lamp. I thought it said pink flesh. I was like, okay. <laughs> There's no light bulb. It's an incredible invention. When not in use, this bed folds into an extremely easy to draw box. I just tried to fucking... Come on! Come on! Come on! Okay. Wait, does this... No. Alpha's updated status. Just realized I didn't watch Undyne fight the human. Alpha's, Alpha's updated status! <laughs> well, I know she's unbeatable. I'll ask her about it later. For now, I gotta call up the human and guide them. Thanks, bud. Oh. oh, you're cute. I'm gonna hug you. Give Vulcan a hug. It warms your heart. And your whole body. Ouch! Ah, so lovey! Shit, fuck, shit, fuck, shit, fuck. Oh, okay, this isn't that hard. Oh, okay, cool. I can leave. Ha ha! Gonna call them in a minute! Come on, Alphys! The whooshing sound of steam and cogs fills you with determination. Okay, um... Yeah. Uh... No, no, I'll go a little farther. Okay. Sunned airplane gets in the way, not on purpose or anything. I'm gonna flirt. You tell Sunned airplane it has an impressive wingspan. Huh? You sicko! Oh shit, fuck, fuck, fuck. Looks over, then turns up its nose. Not too close. Eh? H human? Oh, do I have to... Okay. Goodbye. I hate using the phone. I don't want to do this, LMAO. God, I love her. Oh, I can't. Okay. Oh, wait, what? Oh. Oh. Uh, no, because that is a weapon and I don't. E no, fuck you! I do not use those. OMG, I've had my claw over the last digits for five minutes. 
OMG, I'm just gonna do it. I'm just gonna call. So freaking cute. Click. Whoever was calling hung up before you answered it. Silly Billy. Uh, uh, hi. So, the blue lasers... I, I mean, Alf is here. Hi. The blue lasers won't hurt you if you don't move. The orange ones... Um, you have to be moving, and they... Um, they won't, uh... Move through those ones. Bye. She's so freaking cute. OMG, I did it! Claws haven't shook like that since Untine called me to ask about the weather. Wait, there's no weather down here! Why did she call me? No, fuck! Okay, cool. Lasers have been deactivated. Oh my god, I forgot to tell them where to go. Cute pic of me right now. It's a photo of a garbage can with several pink glittery filters over it. Me too, Elvis. Me too. Uh, uh, Elvis is here. The, the northern door will stay locked until you solve the puzzles on the right and left. I, I think you should go to the right first. Sure thing, Elf. Hey guys, what's up? The way to work is blocked, so I had to catch Metaton's show on my phone. <laughs> the special effects were amazing today. That human almost looked real. I'm literally standing right behind you. Look at me. This is cool, dude. Metaton? Yeah, he's the most popular star in the underground. His fan club probably has at least two, no, three dozen members. It's weak. Wonder if it would be unfun if I explained the puzzle. I got this, Alphys, don't worry. The door leading through the area is closed, so I tried the puzzle, but I kept running out of ammo, and it kept restarting, and my two coworkers won't help? It's like they don't even want to go to work? I got this. Hell oh, yep. Thanks. Alpha's here. The, the blue laser seems totally impassable, but but as the royal scientist, I I have some tricks up my sleeve. I'll hack into the Hotland laser database and take it out. Thanks, mate. Ooh, you remind me of Flame Princess from Adventure Time. Finally, someone turned off that laser. Now that we're free, we can... Well, uh, I guess we'll just keep standing here. We were hanging out, and suddenly a bunch of puzzles reactivated out of nowhere. This is a huge problem. It rules. They gotta cancel school over this. Okay. Um. There we go. Da 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 da. Swag. Ow. Dun dun dun. Whatever, I'll just explain it. Hun. Um, I, I think, um... Hey, about the puzzles on the left and right, they're a bit difficult to explain, but... Uh, uh, you already solved them? Awesome! Hun. Spinny. Oh no. Hey, it's kind of dark in there, right? Don't worry. I'll act into the light system and brighten it up. Fuck! Oh no. Oh yes! Welcome, beauties, to the Underground's premiere cooking show. Preheat your ovens because we've got a very special recipe for you today. We're going to be making a cake. My lovely assistant here will gather the ingredients. Be uh, everyone give them a big hand. We'll need sugar, milk, and eggs. Go for it, sweetheart. I got you. Shouldn't set all of that on the eggs. Perfect, great job, beautiful. We've got all of the ingredients we need to bake the cake. Milk, sugar, eggs. 
Oh my, what a magnificent moment. How could I forget? We're missing the most important ingredient. A human soul. How about no? Hello? I'm kind of in the middle of something here. Wait a second. C couldn't you try to make a... C couldn't you use a... Can you make a substitution to the recipe? A substitution? You mean, use a different non-human ingredient? Why? Uh, what if someone's... Vegan? Vegan? Uh, well, I mean, that's a brilliant idea, Alphys! Actually, I happen to have an option right here. Empty tea brand, always convenient, human soul flavor substitute. A can of which is just over on that counter. Well, darling, why don't you go get it? I uh, yawned again. Shakes away from the moment a little bit. <laughs> God. Rapunzel, Rapunzel, let down your can of human soul substitute. By the way, our show runs on a strict schedule. If you can't get the can in the next one minute, we'll just have to go back to the original plan. So, better start climbing, beautiful. You know what? Oh, oh no, there, there's not enough time to climb up. F fortunately, I might have a plan. When I was upgrading your phone, I added a few uh, features. You see that huge button that says jetpack? Watch this. Alphys, you know just how to make my day. Th there, you should have just enough fuel to reach the top. Now get up there. Hell yep. This is a small child! Stop trying to kill them! God. Whoop. Wait, fuck. Okay. Dickhead. Metaton, please. Oh shit, okay. Fuck. Oh, thank god, okay. My, my. It seems you've bested me. But only because you had the help of the brilliant Dr. Elphis. Oh, I loathe to think of what would have happened to you without her. Well, toodles. Not even gonna finish your food? Oh yes, about the substitution. Haven't you ever seen a cooking show before? I already baked the cake ahead of time, so forget it! W wow, we, we did it! We, we really did it! G great job out there, team. W well, uh, anyway, let's keep heading forward. Heck yep. Okay, I'm gonna... An ominous structure looms in the distance. You're filled with determination. Peace out for now, home dogs.